So hello, I'm going to stand right here rather than trying to move. Um, and um, good morning to you all from California where the sun has just risen. Um, I'm Claudia Lamoureux in First Life. You can see my tag above my head in white. Um, Claudia Linden in Second Life. And as uh, Anna said, I'm the Education Programs Manager at Linden Lab, and I've had the great pleasure to support the innovative work of the Open University in Second Life. Um, thank you for inviting me to be here for the opening of the new Access Center today. I'm excited today to have the opportunity to introduce the new Vice Chancellor of the Open University, Martin Bean. I met Martin in June in Palo Alto, California at a digital media and learning think tank or brainstorm where he hinted at more trailblazing things to come from the Open University. I'm very happy to be meeting him again today in Second Life. And I like to say that the person who created your avatar did a really fine job, Martin. I would recognize you anywhere. Um, for those of you still getting to know him, Martin brings over 20 years of business leadership and training in education from his work in organizations like Microsoft, Novell, Sylvan Learning, and Thomson Learning. He has created and managed multi-stakeholder partnerships of public, private, and not-for-profit organizations. That sounds like a collaboration guru to me. And he's known for growing complex enterprises. In an interview before a keynote he delivered recently at the Association for Learning Technology Conference, Martin said he sees opportunities to fundamentally alter the nature of learning by using technology to shift education from being content-centric to people-centric. I think that's a great note on which to turn the event over to Martin Bean. Martin will speak next 30 minutes, and then I'll facilitate some questions and answers. So let's welcome Martin. Thank you, Claudia, and uh, good morning to you, bright and early in the morning. And uh, good afternoon, good evening, wherever everybody else is. I, I welcome you. This is uh, uh, the first opportunity I've had to give a lecture in, in Second Life. And I, I must tell you, I'm, I'm assured by those around me that I'm one of the, the first vice chancellors in the United Kingdom to do so, which makes me, me very, very happy. And I'm, I'm just delighted to see so many of you have, have joined me here today. You know, one of the things that uh, I really um, was a driving force for me wanting to actually join the Open University was all about the fact that it had this amazing mission. It had this mission of being open to people, places, methods, and ideas. And, and I've got to tell you, Claudia, that I, I think that that mission is just as relevant for Second Life as it is for everything else that the Open University does. And in many ways, Second Life is the embodiment of that mission. You know, we've, we've been open to people no matter where they live, no matter what they do. We wanted to be open to them, to give them access to a high quality, higher education experience. And um, Second Life actually creates some tremendous opportunities for that, as you've all experienced much more than me. Um, and I'll be talking a little bit about some more of that as we move through. But it's also being able to uh, be open to places. One of the things that we do, I believe, as well, if not better than any higher education institution in the world, is to actually create a quality higher education experience no matter where people are. Um, and today is a wonderful example of that. If you actually look at who's attending this little uh, get together that we've got today, you'll see that we've got people uh, drawn from um, uh, many different parts of the world, as well as from, I'm sure, many different locations that they're operating from uh, as we meet together and, and congregate for this chat today. Then the final two are sort of methods and ideas. And the Open University was really born out of using the technology of the day um, in innovative and creative ways to open up access to education. Now, the, the technology of the day happened to be television when we first began, as we worked with the BBC to broadcast our lectures into people's homes. Um, and today, um, the Open University is very proud of the fact that we've, we've maintained pace with the methods of the day. And today, again, is just a wonderful example of that. And finally, being open to ideas. And much of the work that you all have done in trailblazing the application of technology into education 